Fox 46 chief political correspondent Emma Withrow is live in the studio with more details on the bonds that are supposed to get passed tonight, Emma. Right, Lindsay. Well, ironically, it's not cheap to develop affordable housing. And tonight, the city council will vote to approve issuing bonds for three different apartment complexes for low-income families. And all three will add up to about $60 million. Now, some of that funding will come from the city, and the rest will come from the state and federal government. The three apartment complexes will be specifically geared towards low-income families with a median income below $60,000 for a family of four. And I talked to a spokesperson for the development company in charge of the projects, and she says these apartments will finally give so many families on the verge of eviction a place to easily afford. As a result of these bonds, we're going to be able to create 462 affordable housing units. That is absolutely so necessary in a time of crisis. We are seeing these growing tent communities. We know the economy is really unsettled right now as a result of the pandemic, and these resources are needed sooner than later. And there's no word on when construction will be finished for these complexes. But some of the council members I spoke with today said construction has already begun at one of them. And now, although these approvals for these bond measures for affordable housing is somewhat symbolic because most of the funding came from the federal level, city council members told me it's going to be instrumental in the grand scheme of Charlotte's housing crisis. Back to you guys.